shush. Give me a sec. Give it up, or I swear I will Let's drop start it. again. It looks like you dropped it in the mug. <laughs> drop it. I was like, oh no. What are you? Hang on. What happened there? <laughs> Did you drop the tea. <laughs> I'll do it. I swear I'll do it. Tell me what I need to know. I am not messing around. Amy? Shh. Give me a sec. Give it up, or I swear I will drop you right in that boiling water. Are you mugging a tea bag? Don't be silly. I'm giving you until the count of three. One. What are you hoping to... Two. You have done some strange stuff before, Amy, but this may be the weirdest. Two and a half. I don't think tea counts. What? Counting. I don't think tea does that. I mean, for all it knows, between one and three comes two, two and a half, guinea pig, and Fruit Loops. Heck, it might think it's got like a good week before it needs to make a decision. I hadn't thought of that. All right. Listen up, you. This is how it's going to go. Either you start talking or you're getting thrown in there. I'm going to count to three. And that consists of the numbers one, two, two and a half, and then three. Three is when you get dunked, understand? None of this one, two, three, and then dunk on three. Yeah, You may not even hear three if your ears are at the bottom because they'll be touching the water at that point. Now, one. Oops. What exactly are you trying to beat out of it? Not beat out of it. Threaten. I tried beating some of the others, but they broke, and not in the good way. Still, what are you... Hang on. Two. What? What are you hoping? Oh, right. Oh, I was watching a bunch of reruns late last night. Decide how late. I don't know. Round two. And one of the commercials was for this chamomile and vanilla tea. Chamomile and vanilla. You mean chamomile. Oh, is that how you pronounce it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I would not have guessed that. It looks like chamomile. Or maybe chamomile. Chamomile. Didn't they say it on the commercial? <laughs> maybe, but I had the TV muted. Everyone was sleeping and I actually like watching reruns without the sound anyway. Uh -huh. That way I can make up my own dialogue. Why does this not surprise me? Anyway. Commercial said, and I quote, that chamomile and vanilla tea holds the secret to a good night's rest. And I thought, what an amazing coincidence that this particular commercial would come on just now while I'm watching TV. 2 a.m. Right. So I figure it's some kind of sign. I mean, you know how much trouble I've had sleeping ever since I got my grades last week and... Been up this whole time? It's nearly one in the afternoon. Have you really been up since... Anyway... Um, so I figure if this tea holds the secret, I'm... First off, Amy, it's a commercial. Companies can say anything they want on... I know that. You know, you think I don't know that? I did my research. Uh-huh. What? Research. I looked up Chamomile and Vanilla Tea, and their website confirmed that this blend of tea has held the secret to a good night's sleep for nearly 4,000 years. They're... 4,000 years. I mean, holy shit, Donna. How could we let that much time slip by without trying to ferret out that information? I'm not the first person to have a sleepless night. Whose website? But then it occurred to me that maybe people have tried, but they just didn't know how, you know? <laughs> so, uh, wait, what? What website? Uh, from the commercial? <laughs> They'd know, right? Right. So... I thought maybe people had the same thought, you know, 4,000 years, that's a long time. Someone must have tried this already. But then I thought, nowadays we have new techniques, like all that waterboarding stuff that was in the news a while back. Has anyone ever tried something new and clever like that? Whoa, slow down, Amy. First, God, where do you even begin? First, waterboarding is like 600 years old. It is? Yeah, not new. Second. <sighs> Waterboarding is a way to simulate drowning. You can't 
waterboarded tea bag because it doesn't have a mouth. Oh. What you're threatening to do to it is actual drowning or boiling, and both of those have been used as torture techniques for at least 4,000 years. Oh. Also, consider this particular tea bag, which came from that box over there. I figured this particular tea bag has itself not been around for 4,000 years. It was probably manufactured like a year ago. They said it was an ancient Chinese secret. The stuff comes from Tulsa. I am very disappointed in you. It's not the tea bags. Two and a half. Oh my God, give me that. No, I'm going to get the secret out of this little fucker no matter what it takes. Just give me, give me. It's obviously not going to talk its head all the time in the world. And I have an idea. (gasps) Oh my God. 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 I can't believe you just did that. Amy. I mean, I know I was threatening it, but those were just threats. I never would have really. Amy. God, look at that. Oh, it's life essence is being sucked out of it. It's swirling around like, like. Hey, it's kind of like when the Dementors are sucking the life out of Harry and Sirius Black. You remember? Amy. Oh my God. You. You're the Dementor in this. How could you do this? I thought. I thought I knew you. We had microbiology together. I, I never suspected that you had this cruel, vicious streak in you. Not like this. I know you're overtired, but... What are you? Some kind of heartless terrorist? Me? How could you do that without even letting it say goodbye to its loved one? You beat the crap out of like five tea bags over there, Amy. Five, at least. Accidents. All accidents. Every single one. I never meant to hurt them. I had no idea how fragile they were. Five times? First time, I thought maybe it was just that one that was defective. Then after the second, I thought maybe if I hit them instead of pretending to rip. But but then I tried. Oh, Donna, what have I done? What have I become? I'm just like you. A monster. A terrible Horrible harbinger of death and destruction. Come here, bring it in. It's okay. It's okay. Let it all out. That's right. Oh, don't you worry about ruining my new blouse. It's fine. It's already two whole days old, and you know, I don't like to wear things for more than one hour before someone leaks mucus all over. Oh my. Oh. No. Fine. I got an A minus. I know. But it was in cellular biology. That's a tough class. My, my. Your parents will understand. It's okay. But. I'm sure. Everyone else in the class will still envy and hate you next semester. Really? You're not just saying that? (laughs) Of course I'm not. There, there. That's a girl. That's right. Just sleep. (sighs) You are so buying me a new blouse. (laughs) 